tree they are under to expand and this lets the hibernating ants know that spring is here. Scouts are then sent out to feel the temperature outside and when the temperature is good as well as the sun shines they sunbathe. Their black and red body absorbs the sun's warm rays, which then heats up the worker. The worker then crawls down to the nest and gives her newly acquired heat to the brood and queens. When she is cold again, she then heads up for another round. The ants effectively use this method to heat their nest up from the inside. In spring, you can witness these sunbathing behaviors by the ants as they form large bodies on top of the mounds, collecting heat from the sun. But why are they so eager to get started this early in spring? The answer to that you can get some months later, alates. European wood ants produce alates early in the year. Because of the extreme winter cold, to get the alates flying this early is quite an accomplishment. The bewinged male and female alates then takes to the air. Some with less success than others. The reason for them developing alates this early is because some of the species in the European wood ant group are parasitic, meaning that the queens will roam around throughout the summer looking for a host colony. Getting up early in the year is a huge advantage since they have much more time to roam around. These parasitic queens then find a host colony which they then take over. Scientists are still not sure how they do it, but the main hypothesis is that they copy the pheromones of the host colony and pretends to be their queen. They can then crawl down to the brood chambers, find the queen and kill her, effectively taking over the colony. The European wood ants are almost like the army ants of Europe. They are noticed throughout the forests and wage advanced warfare with rivaling colonies. The most comparable behavior of the army ants is their marching. The wood ants many times form clear foraging trails throughout the forest where they carry food, construction materials and even brood around to different satellite nests. The wood ants is built to carry things long distances. Their highly raised body structure and long legs gives them speed over the rough woodland terrain. Their mandible shape and size are perfectly suited to carry and drag. If the European moose is the king of the forest, the wood ants are the army. With total dominance on the forest floor and equipped with advanced chemical weapons, they are a true force to beware of in the vast European forests.